Hi everyone, uh, welcome to this new video. Uh, in a break from the usual techno babble, you know, the thing about cloud security, artificial intelligence, I thought it would be a good idea uh, to give some good old fashioned career advice on cloud security job roles, you know, specifically the different job roles that are there in the market and how to go about getting them and what they do. Okay, uh, before we move ahead, guys, please do like and subscribe this, like this video and subscribe to this channel. So you get notified about new videos which I'm uploading and it, it, it will really help the channel grow also. So please do like, subscribe to this button and click on the bell icon. Okay, so let's get started guys. So one common question which I get asked a lot is uh, who does exactly what in cloud security, right? So we see a lot of job postings for cloud security engineers, cloud security architects, consultants, etc. right? So I thought it would be a good idea to break down these roles, okay? I want to go over the three most common cloud security job roles in the market. What is needed to do them and what you can, like how you can get this function, what are sort of skills are needed. So one disclaimer is uh, a lot of times there's a lot of overlap, a lot of times and these job roles depend on the nature of the business, what sector. I've tried to keep it as broad as possible, okay? So let's see how it goes, guys. And let's get started with the very first job role. That would be the cloud security engineer, right? So a cloud security engineer, he focuses more on the day to the running of your cloud security ecosystem. He's supposed to know all the different cloud security roles that are present. Uh, he usually he coordinates with the different other cybersecurity teams also to make sure the different controls are working properly. Like if you want to integrate your SIM solution, this is the guy who would do it, right? Uh, this is the guy who will be monitoring your AWS security hub, or uh, say your Microsoft Defender, Windows Defender for cloud, those sort of things, right? And he will be the one who's improving upon the same. He is the one who's fixing the audit findings which are coming out, the security findings. For a lot of people, this is usually their entry position into the cloud security world, okay? Uh, what sort of skills are needed to become a cloud security engineer? Well, uh, good news is you don't immediately need cloud experience to break into this role. You usually just need cloud cyber security experience. And you, then you can laterally move into this role in most organizations as they go on to the cloud journey, right? I've seen this happen a lot for a lot of organizations. A few other things, but you do need, uh, I've listed below, you should have experience with infrastructure as code. As more cloud security engineers, uh, they require they are required to integrate security tools into them. I did a similar video on this, which I'll link above, and you can take a look at that. Uh, you should have basic knowledge of scripting, you know, Bash and PowerShell, not a deal breaker, but you should know. You should have no knowledge of cloud native tools like AWS Config, Guard Duty, Security Hub, Microsoft Defender for Cloud. And these are easily available on YouTube, or uh, let me know if you want me to do a video on them, right? You should have knowledge of on-prem tooling like Endpoint Security, DLP, SIEM Solutions. I would definitely recommend doing certification like, like Azure 500 for Microsoft uh, Solutions Architect Associate as they will give you a great foundation on which to build your cloud security knowledge, okay? Okay, so mo let's move on to a more senior role like a cloud security architect, okay? So that's a more senior role and that's a more specialized role and requires more experience in cloud security. I would definitely not recommend applying for this role if you don't have any cloud experience because in this role you're supposed to be a subject matter expert, okay? This role does architecture and design reviews. He provides guidance around the best practices and frameworks. You should have an in-depth understanding of how cloud works. For example, with Google Cloud, you should know how cloud functions work, Kubernetes work, and how they integrate with the different cloud services. And this usually this role defines cloud security frameworks and is expected to deliver upon them. Uh, that's why the pay scale is also much higher. So just do a Google search for Google Cloud Security Architect and you will see the huge salary scales that are there because the, of the expertise which is required to do this role, right? But so what sort of skills are needed if you want to become this? F most important would be hands-on experience in the cloud, right? Like AWS, GCP, Azure, as well as knowledge of cloud security architecture and security engineering. You should have like a professional or specialty level certification, like the Google Professional Cloud Architect. I've done a video on that, I'll link it above. Uh, or like the AWS security specialty, right? Uh, you should definitely know DevOps, threat modeling, API calls, how they work. Right, you should be confident in like providing cloud security expertise and presenting your suggestions. Okay, uh, definitely know about SAML and single sign-on like Azure AD and Okta. Okay, so this is how uh, like a cloud security architect works. Okay, uh, the next one would be the job title of a cloud security would be cloud security consultant. Uh, this is the last role I want to mention. Uh, I can speak about this role a bit more confidently because this is the role I'm currently doing in Amazon Web Services here in London. Uh, there's sometimes a lot of overlap between this role and that of a cloud security architect. But the key difference would be that, that this role is more customer facing uh, majority of the time. Usually you're required to work closely with customers and provide guidance for a cloud customer's cloud security journey. 
you get involved right from the start and you assist the customer until everything is marketed and the customer is at a good security posture and you're like in an advisory role. So what skills are needed? Well, the most important skill without a doubt would be good presentation and communication skills. As usually you'll be working with customers and these customers are not very familiar with the cloud. Okay. And they need guidance. Okay. You should be able to articulate complex stuff in like easy way to understand in workshops and presentations. You should have a solid technical background. I would suggest starting with a non-security certification. Why? Uh, because you, you would understand fully the cloud works and that you can respond to any customer queries. For example, in AWS, I would suggest getting the AWS solutions architect associate or professional one and then moving on to the security rules. This will give you the ability to troubleshoot and solve any problems with the rise. Uh, what else you should know about security standards like PCI DSS, ISO 27001, GDPR, because customers want to know cloud in the context of their regulated environments, right? And lastly, I think good project and time management skills. That should be obvious really because you will be working on projects with the customers and time and project management is essential, right? Okay. So these are the things, these are the three most common job roles uh, I think that are present in the cloud security market right now. And these are the skills you would need guys. So I've, I've tried to keep it as simple as possible. Uh, but let me know if you feel there are other roles which I should have touched upon. I hope this video was useful guys. Uh, before you go, please do uh, like and subscribe this video. Sorry, I keep reminding you guys uh, so that this channel grows. And thank you very much. Let me know if you have any suggestions in the comment section below. Okay, thank you guys and wish you all the luck in you. Best of luck in your cloud security journey.